Welcome to this video tutorial about the Dollybar ERP and CRM system. In this video, we will look at how to use the Members module for managing Foundation members in Dollybar. Prerequisites Activate the module members from the menu Home, Setup, Modules. Grant permission on the Members module for your users. For more advanced information on how to set up permissions to users, you can watch our video Users, Groups and Permissions. Creating a member The Members module can be used to manage the members of a foundation and their subscription. Click on the appropriate menu link to add a new member. Provide a username and password. Choose a member type and the nature of the member. Note that you can create new member types from the Member Types menu. Specify if subscription is required and if voting is allowed. Duration defines the membership duration. Coming back to the member creation process, provide personal details such as the member's name and address. Click on the button to create the member. Once created, the member is in the draft status. Click on the validate button to validate the member. The status now changes to Validated and Awaiting Subscription. Adding a subscription for the member. Click on the Subscriptions tab and click on the appropriate button to create a subscription. Choose the subscription start and end dates and enter the subscription amount. Choose the appropriate complementary action. Note that if the member is linked to a third party, the invoice options can be chosen for the subscription transaction. Otherwise, you can enter the relevant payment information to capture the payment details for the subscription transaction. New members can also self-register and self-subscribe using the public self-subscription page. If you have enabled an online payment module like Stripe or PayPal, you can set up the application so that the user will be able to make the subscription payment just after the registration. The member and the subscription will be automatically recorded and the user will receive an email. The invoice can also be automatically attached to the email. Module features you can upload any files for a particular member by using the appropriate menu. The Events and Agenda tab captures all the events related to the member. If you wish to terminate the member, click on the appropriate button. Click on the List menu to list all the members. The list views are also available based on the member status, such as draft, validated, up to date, out of date, and terminated. Statistics provides a bird's eye view of all members and member subscriptions. You can generate business cards for all members or specific members from the appropriate menu. Choose a format and click on the button to generate the appropriate business cards in the PDF format, which can then be sent for printing. Use the Tags menu to categorize members based on tags. You can create your own custom tags and map members to those tags. Renewal of subscription. Enable the module Schedule task so that an automated task will be run every day 
to send email reminders to members whose subscription has expired and needs to be renewed. If you have enabled a payment module like Stripe or PayPal, you can also add a payment link. By editing the email template configured for the renewal reminder email. So the member will be able to make the payment by clicking on the link in the email and the subscription and the invoice will be automatically generated and recorded. There are also plenty of other features that can be enabled from the module setup, such as email templates and the link for the public self-registration and self-subscription page. You can also add your own custom fields and define default values or mandatory fields. Thank you for watching this video tutorial. Visit www.dolibar.org to learn more.